Spiked Balls is a great mid-game tower, but how should you be cross-pathing it? Well, a 300 spec tree places a spiked ball down every 1.75 seconds, and upgrading it to a 320 makes it lay down spells 1.79 times faster. Compare this to the 302 that increases the lifespan of each ball by 50 seconds, gives us targeting options, and makes the spec tree attack four times faster for the first two and a half seconds of every round. To save us all from scary math, here's a graph that shows how many spells each cross path puts down over time. As we can see, the 320 will outpace the 302 in most scenarios, especially since there are only two rounds in the first 100 that take over 82 seconds to spawn all the balloons. But how long it takes to spawn the balloons and how long it takes them to get to the end of the track are two completely different times. So here is the takeaway. If you're on a more difficult map that has several tracks, go with the 302 as the smart targeting will be a lifesaver. But if you're on a long, easy map that only has one track, going with a 320 will do you wonders. There is one caveat to this though. If you have any sort of stalling that will extend the rounds past the 82 second equilibrium mark, go with a 302 as those long life spalls will come in clutch.